I'm a Are you on Christian? I'm a name Adi. Adi? Yes, I'm a name Adi, otherwise a teacher. This means just that. On those days, the curfew hour is with the 24 hours. And uh, we don't, we are at the point where we don't have enough beds. We don't want to get to the point where we just can't take anyone else in the hospital. Or someone dies because they are deprived of a service because we have had to take a doctor and put them on the COVID ward or take a bed from another ward to put it on the COVID ward. We're trying to avoid that. So we have established that there will be seven no movement days. Watch your windows. And these will be Sunday, August the 22nd. What's that? Monday, August the 23rd. Bomba. Tuesday, August the 24th. Sunday, August the 29th. Monday, August 30th. Tuesday, August 31st. What's here? And uh, Sunday, September 5th. So we, we want to digest that a bit. Yeah. No movement days means just that. On those days, the curfew hour is would be 24 hours. You know, spend it with your family, call up your, so family, your, your, mem one, your yeah. family member, your movement day. Tuesday, August 24th, no movement day. This is not a holiday. Them can't go on love for no radio. movement on that day. But it doesn't mean that you should not be What's working the 25th? from home. What's it on video? So we are expecting you, as many of you who can work from home, to continue to be productive, to do your work at home. Mm. Then the following Sunday, August the 29th, that's a no movement day. The following Monday, after that Sunday, um, no movement day. Okay. That would be August 30th. And then Tuesday, August the 31st, that's another no movement day. And then Sunday, the 5th of September, no movement day. The objective is that we are giving the Ministry of Health um, that in addition to wearing your mask, in addition to maintaining your six feet apart, um, and in addition to sanitizing your hands, also pay attention to the number of persons gathered. Obviously, <coughs> if you're going onto a bus, there might be more persons on the bus. But again, you take your precaution. If, if you are going into a room, you want to make sure Alright guys, so this is to start my lockdown vlog, my seven days of no movement vlog. I'm at the supermarket right now. I'm at the supermarket right now in a Christiana. I'm gonna go buy some tomato. Sorry. Everything. I'm gonna go walk around first and come back here. Yeah? Right. Wow, it's so packed compared to the last time me and grandpa was here. Oh, I'm gonna buy everything. I don't even know what I want to buy. I want to buy carrots. Probably I'm going to buy a melon. I want to buy a tomato. Please tell people to look nice here. I have a little skill in. Alright. What am I going to look like? Grandpa got me yam. So I'm good on that. I think I'm going to go back to the first lady and buy some tomato. Evening, how much for your pumpkin? Huh? Hundred dollar pump? Yeah. Oh. Give me two pounds? Yeah, our sweet potato looks so nice. Huh? Yeah, I have a bracelet, but it broke. Alright guys, so so far I got pumpkin. 
green pepper, tomato, cucumber, and one pear. Um, I think I want to buy some fruit if I can find it. Um, remember, I already have yam from grandpa. I want to buy some carrots. But I don't want a beanie beanie carrot. Okay. Evening, how much are your carrots? $100. $100? Yes. Yeah. You made it $250. $250? Okay. Okay. Guys, I'm going to buy a melon and I think that's going to be it. Money, I run out for me. <laughs> Thank you. Wow, guys. I got a nice melon. My fridge is going to look nice tonight. <laughs> I'm heading back to the car. I think that's it. I'm going to have so much sweet pepper. I'm going to buy $100 skillion. I'm going to buy some skillion from somebody else. Can I have $100 worth of skillion? I'm Just because I froze some skeleton. Thank you. I froze some skeleton. Um, so I really want to make sure that I have some fresh ones. But anywho, I'm about to leave. Boy, my hand full up. I'll show you guys what I got when I reach home. But for now, I'm going to try to reach home. You see me? Yeah. Uh, $100. Yeah. Do you record me, baby? Do you record? No. Oh, so you record? Do you record the ginger? Huh? I'm going to make some carrots. Married. I'm married again. What do you mean, why? No. Huh? Married again. No. So I just bought what I had to buy, but I'm stuck between two taxi. Taxi in front of me now move and the taxi just come. It's alright. Taxi just come lock me in. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm just trying to get home. I'm just so grateful though that I got the stuff here. Because I don't know how Carnation Market stay. So I'm glad I got I think I spent I spent about $1,900, so that's roughly, let's call it $18, anywhere from 15 to, anywhere from 15 to 18 US dollars. I think that was a great spend. Um, like I said a while ago, when I reach home, I'll show you guys exactly what I got. Um, I think there's a supermarket close to me, so tomorrow I might just head there. I'm gonna go on cheap supermarket. If you live in Kingston, tell me the best cost effective supermarkets there are in Kingston because Shoppers Fair isn't expensive but it's not that cheap and um, Mega Mart is definitely not cheap. So, if you know of anything that can help me out, I really just want to save money and get the stuff that I want to get. So, drop your best supermarket with the best deals down below please so we can all benefit I might as well pull out on Netflix because I wait for the money or move and just come in my car for my vlog <laughs> wow I picked so the car in front of me here I'm trying to actively not catch people's license plate but it seems like I'm going to pull off you want to find a video? <laughs> You don't want me to pay you when you're walking on my video? Are you walking on my video? You have to pay me. Are you a step over more now for coming on my video? You have to pay me. We can't afford you. You have to pay me. You, you are you one Christiana? Yeah? You have to pay me for video, Christiana. Are you one Christiana? <laughs> yeah. I'm in Addy. Addy? Yeah. Addy boss? I'm in Addy, otherwise the teacher. Otherwise the teacher. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. no, guys. I was just trying to show you how um pop Christiana pop my wind up my window because I'm in a trust. Um please pack up brother. I can imagine how town lit. This reminds me of Grand Market. <laughs> Grand Market during Corona. 
Yeah. You know the night video? You want the night video? This is why I love Jamaican people. Love Jamaican people, man. But um, McGovern, you see me? Just have to lift up and lift out, is it? All right, so with regards to the lockdown, um, I'm not for or against it. I feel like obviously, you know, the government has to do what the government has to do in order to um, keep a safe country. And if that is a lockdown, then that's a no movement lockdown that we need. So that's fine, I'm okay with that. All right, you guys, so I'm gonna give you a quick haul of what I got at the market today. Um, it's so late, it's basically the next morning. Uh, it's literally almost 12 o'clock, but I'm about to unpack these now. I've had the wildest nights, like you would not believe. I'm gonna have to probably do a mini story time in the next video. It's so crazy, um, I'm all bruised up. <laughs> it's so crazy, you know what? We got, I think, I can't even remember the specifics. I definitely know I got four, um, four pounds. Four pounds, yes, I believe it's four pounds of carrots because it was, I believe, a hundred dollars a pound, which I was like, wow, that's a steal. Maybe it's not a steal to anybody else, but I'm like, a hundred dollars a pound for carrots, of course. I think this is about two pounds of tomatoes, and I believe it was like a hundred and twenty, hundred and fifty. Um, I also got some cucumbers or Jamaicans call it cucumber um, I definitely want to make some juice that's why I got so much carrots in the first place because I can make juice and I can still have a good amount of them left over yeah and then same thing for the cucumber no, um, I had some change and I needed fresh scallion because I keep scallion in my freezer. I always have fresh scallion in a jar in my fridge with water and then I have backup for when my fresh scallion is done. So I like to use this. I think what I'm going to probably do is use the one in my freezer and chop up this and put it in the freezer. But I'm still thinking about it. Then she give me time. I know them always like to marry the time and the scallion. And I believe this was a hundred dollars, yeah. Uh, I got some green pepper. Got some more green pepper. Uh, is this old man who stopped me? Um, so you know, I'm just gonna buy some from him. I said, all right. I really like green pepper. I love using green pepper in my eggs. So I decided to, to get green pepper and tomato. I use my eggs like crazy. So it's always nice to have a whole bunch because they always go the fastest in my fridge. Bought this pair. This man helped me park. Um, so just my way of repairing, repair, <laughs> repaying him. Um, I bought pear from him, and then I got some ginger because one next look at you that hassle me. So I must yeah, I have to buy something. So me I look around and I basically had tomato, I had green pepper, and me never need no onion. So I'm gonna get ginger from him. I'll put the ginger in my juice. And then I got a melon. The melon was $500. This was $100. And the pear was, I believe, $200 or something along those lines. And I also got pumpkin. Um, I bought pumpkin from one lady. She was kind. This lady was kind. She dropped her price um, for me. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in the morning. Peace out. Alright, guys, I didn't eat so much in this supermarket shopping trip but I do have bread wine milk I have some um, tortilla chicken wings orange juice cheese and burger and yeah so this quick trip is really packed here um, so as soon as I get out of here I'll pull you guys out and talk to you
but it's really packed so I don't really want to show you how much people it looks like a hurricane is coming all right since I'm done with the supermarket um, and the reason why what you're seeing is purely all I need um, I've already been to the supermarket this week and I already have stuff that I shipped down so when y'all look at my basket and you're like, oh my god, someone help me, or that's not enough, or where's this, where I already have it. We just want to go back home. After I'm done doing this, I'm going to buy some chicken. I'm probably going to get chicken breasts. I don't know. I'm in the mood for like, okay, no, I'm not. I'm going to get wings, legs, all parts. But anywho, I'm out of here, guys. Guys, it's officially an hour until lockdown. Okay, well, remember I told you I do weird stuff. Um, it's seven o'clock. Lockdown starts at eight, and it doesn't lift up until Wednesday morning at five a.m. Currently, I'm about to watch, I know, a big child. I'm about to watch The Legend of, <clears throat> of Korra. If you watch Avatar and Legend of Korra, then you'd understand. The, the drawing itself isn't the best, but I like the story. I like the plot, I like the message um, that it gives, so yeah. Good morning, guys. It's officially day one of lockdown we have two more days to go i'm about to edit a video um i'm gonna try to reach out to some clients wish them the best during this lockdown um i don't know cook something eat something try to work out try to find something to do i mean it is only sunday so i should have the majority of stuff to do on the first day when Tuesday comes around, then I'll be doing God knows what. I really wish I had bought some spray paint um, so I could have worked on my dressers. Let me show you. I wish I had got some spray paint. Um, I sanded them down pretty well. So like, even though it looks patchy patchy, it's very smooth and I wiped it, wiped it down. That's why you're seeing like little particles it's from the napkin that i used to wipe it down but i wish i had a microfiber cloth but i don't so i'll just have to dust it off before i spray paint it but yeah i'm gonna get rid of those um pieces like this inside piece because i wiped it up and it's like oh and then i'm gonna get rid of that inside piece and find something to substitute with the drawers that's my bedroom <laughs> all right actually I don't know I'm ready I'm ready this is the bedspread that I showed you guys in the haul video and the clothing rack that I showed y'all and this is the rug that I was telling you guys about oh, the place is just coming on nicely mommy said she likes this room I do too um, yeah this is what the room is looking like. I really want to take one of those pictures, but I need to get rid of that thing in the corner or try to hide it and then hide my fan. But girl, anywho, I'm about to dip out of here. This is about to be a real vlog. Guys, I just made the perfect hamburger sandwich. I made it with, I'm gonna start off with the layers in this. So there's a layer of guacamole at the top. Then there's four tomatoes. There's um what is this lettuce lettuce um then there is a fried egg then i have some barbecue sauce then i have a layer of cheese and then hamburgers and then a layer of plantains <laughs> it looks really good uh i'll show you how to make it tomorrow i'm just really hungry right now so tomorrow you'll get the full shabam that's it. Hey guys, so today was day one. It's 6.20 right now. Just in case y'all don't believe. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, anywho, 
I just uploaded a building our dream home in Jamaica. It's Sunday. Um, I haven't done much today. I'm gonna tell you the honest to God truth. I've been so lonely. I've been so sad. Just thinking about like how much stuff that I haven't accomplished and then I'm here. I've been watching like something on Netflix to try to get my mind off it. I ate one time today so I'm about to go make some dinner. Um, that one sandwich that I showed you earlier, yeah, that was the one time I ate. I've been sleeping on and off. It's very lonely, especially for people who live by themselves. This lockdown is just not beneficial to our mental health. But like, I feel so alone. And then, I don't know, like, you know, you're one of those type of people that just, you don't always like to be on the phone. You don't always like to be talking on the phone, but like, being with someone or being in the presence of someone or being in the same house as someone is just so much more just feels better but right now i'm just so alone i feel sad All right guys, so I was gonna put some lettuce on it and some cheese, but I've changed my mind. This is just how it's gonna go. It's not really looking like much, but it's much for me. So <laughs> this is dinner, the struggle meal, but it looks kind of nice. So I'm not mad at it. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go watch something now. Besides, he's not dressed like the avatar. Doesn't the avatar have ponytails? Good afternoon, guys. Um, it is the next day. Lockdown day two. Loading. Uh, I'm trying to create a new vlog intro. I've just downloaded some new fonts. Um, cause I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna go with this, but look at how it's looking. Let me know what you think. What do you think? I'm not sure if I really like this. Like I said, I downloaded some new fonts, and by the way, I get my fonts from the font, thefont.com. That's literally the perfect place to download fonts. And then the next thing that I always do is to make sure it's a hundred percent free. And then this comes up too. Whenever I click 100%, that just automatically comes up. But free for personal use is eh, because you're going to be putting it on YouTube and you're trying to make money, so that's not really personal. Um, unless you're not making money, then that's fine, I guess. But if you want to make money, do 100% free, and then you'll come... Uh-oh. Let me click on this one. So it will say 100% free. Sometimes it will say 100% free for personal and commercial use. Basically, that's what I was trying to show you. But anyways, let's move into some of the fonts that I downloaded. So basically, you download them. And then they'll come up like this icon. In which you then double tap. And then you'll double tap on that one. And then you'll install the font. And that's really, that's really it. So now I'm going to grab a text box. Um, I always type basic because it's very simple. There's nothing about it. My video is very short because this title is what I normally use. So, um, anywho. anywho, so going to basic and let me look up the font. I think it starts with a U. Oh, this is one of them that I did, but I did this one fun. Let's type fun. Oh, it's right here. Let me make it bigger. I did this one for, um, oh, you can barely see. I did this one for thumbnails because I wanted to write like cute, fun stuff. But what I've noticed is that sometimes people say they can't see it. So what I do, I do drop shadow, which is down here. 
and then most times I increase the drop shadow to a hundred percent so it pops out on the screen more let me get this to focus so you can see so it has this 3d look instead of um sorry guys it has this 3d look instead of a flat look yeah I don't know I think that helps plus when you're on the screen you can see it much better than in this video right now but yeah I'm gonna keep working on this and then I'll catch you guys later it's so boring I'm just not doing anything these past couple hours stop losing your airpods your Mac has a magnet in the upper right hand corner that your airpods will attach to hold up ho ho hold up hold up where's my airpods oh let me let me see I want to see with you guys get up there Bitch. Oh, they lied. They definitely lied. Okay, maybe you have to do two of them at one time. Stop. Why is TikTok making me look like an idiot? Is this not the right? Oh my god, is this fake AirPods? I'm just kidding. They're not fake. They're not fake. But why are they not sticking like. Oh! oh. Ah. It took too long. It took too much too much energy. Where the other one at? Yeah, this is not working out for me. Houston, we've got a problem. The best late night snack. <laughs> well, anytime snack to be honest. Um, yeah, I was watching a video on TikTok and there's a cup noodles museum in Tokyo where you can make your own cup noodles. You can design the container and everything and design the soup. And I thought that was so cool and they like, airtight seal it for you so if you want to keep it um i think that would be such a cool um what's the word such a cool um uh, like how do you describe it guys i don't know why but these past couple months i've been really forgetting words um i'm gonna put this on here so it seals in all the heat oh what's that word like not token but you know something cool that you can bring back I'm gonna swoosh this around um, the water is so heavy or hard hard water that the you can see the little white stuff so I pour out any unnecessary hot water cuz look how hard and white in there is getting if you have any recommendations let your girl know I try to scrub it with um a cleaning brush like one of these it comes with my um juicer so I just also push it in and clean it um whenever I can because that's crazy to me it was the same thing for Portmore but Portmore wasn't as bad as over here Good morning, it is day Sunday, Monday, two, three, the final day for this first half of the lockdown. Um, if you haven't already, please like, comment, and subscribe, and go watch some of the other videos. And if you really do enjoy them and you're not yet subscribed, hit the B-Squad button. <laughs> it hit the
the subscribe button and join the B squad. I actually just washed my face, so that's why it's looking a bit sweaty. But um, I've decided that I'm gonna work from my bedroom today. Um, you know, the office is closed. I had to commute from all the other rooms. I might take a stroll around the veranda. But yeah, I'll be working from my bedroom today. I was actually thinking that I'll work from my veranda today, but it's not really that noisy, but I was hearing other people talk and I'm not feeling it. So I'm just gonna come back inside. Even though I really do need the fresh air, I'm not gonna lie to you. So I think I will set up out here, get the yoga mat and just chill. Um, glass of wine, orange juice, some melon, but yeah, I'm gonna get back to the office. <laughs> I'm gonna actually go make some breakfast, so. All right, so today's breakfast will be some oats. I don't know why it's doing this. It wasn't doing this light thing before, so I'm sorry if that's affecting you. I'll try to resolve it, but yeah. I have the brown sugar and What's this one called? Maple and brown sugar. This one is absolutely the best. The other ones can go on, but this Quaker, I give it to them. They got some really nice things. Guys, I'm about to make some carrot juice before my carrots start to spoil. I've already rinsed them once before, but I'm gonna rinse them again, cut off the edges, I mean the tops and bottoms. Um, I'm gonna use these little, no, I'm gonna leave these small ones, small ones for a salad. I'm gonna grab this big one here. Those two, I'm gonna grab this, 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 and this. And uh, let's grab this other big one just because and I'm gonna grab three cucumbers and I also have ginger Ow. <laughs> okay so this is everything I'm gonna use some carrots ginger and cucumber um, this is my trusted juicer um, I'll link it down below and then this is the little top, you put the fruit in here, push it down. If you need assistance, to use this to push it down more. Um, and that's that. I'm gonna also mix it with some water and put it in, hold on. And put it in this container. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay guys, so this is the finished product with the carrot, cucumber, and ginger. I'm putting it in a freezer so it can like get all goodness and whatever. But obviously when it's just carrots, it's gonna be a lot more orange. But since I added, I think I added three cucumbers. So that's why it has this darker tint, this muddied look, but it tastes so good. So if you have Guinness or 
I don't know, any other type of beer or whatever, or milk or anything like that, you can put that in there because that's what people like to do. But yeah, that's done with. And I have my chicken that I defrosted. I'm gonna put it in the air fryer probably and make some pasta. Um, waiting for all the pieces to dry and then I'm gonna put it back in the box. All right guys, so I was definitely going to make some pasta today, but I got convinced otherwise. Plus Domino's having a buy one large one and you get another large one topping one for free. Domino's, if you're watching this, sponsor me. <laughs> um, but I ended up also getting some wings, so the total came to 4,690, but before the wings it was like 3,200 or something like that. Um, yeah, so it should be here soon. I'm expecting a call from them soon. No wings available. No wings available? Okay. Yeah. You have obviously pizza. No wings, no bonus. Just cheese, bread, garlic, bread, thinnest thing. One box or two boxes. Two boxes, right? How much does that come to with the two boxes? 1,160 and the two pizza, 4,650. Thank you. Yeah. Can you put right. my money? Yeah, 1,650. Guys, our order is on the way. It's telling me that the person has left the store at 625. Um, I don't think the store location is pretty far, so he should be here within the next 10 minutes. Oh, I'm so excited. So I know I put debit card, oh, um, but I couldn't find my card, so I put the cash. Four, four, six, six, six. Uh -huh. six ninety. Could I rub you? Four, four, oh, six fifty. Six fifty? Six fifty? No. Well, maybe we can keep the fifty. <laughs> Where's the pizza? One, two, three, four, five, six. No. Oh, yeah, because yeah, on the bill it says six ninety. System of a glitch. $50. System of a glitch. How do you take so long? I'm not sure where you come from. I think you're out there, the wheelie. No, it's a piece of. Ride safe. 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 Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.